Hello little buddies. This is Rosen Doll reading for you. Today I'm reading the book Madeline's Tea Party. an old house in Paris that is covered with vines lead twelve little girls in two straight lines. They leave the house at half past nine. The smallest one is Madeline. Madeline is hosting an afternoon tea. The party begins at half past three. The girls come in all smartly dressed. Each one wears her Sunday best. One last guest is very late. The girls must sit and wait and wait. At last, at almost half past four, a most selfish boy strolls through the door. He won't say he is sorry or take off his hat. But that is Pepito, the world's greatest brat. Madeline fills each cup with tea. The girls drink it up most happily. Pepito takes a sip. He makes a face. He spits out tea all over the place. This party stings, he says. But you know what's fun? Magic tricks. I will show you one. Watch how the amazing Pepito is able to remove the cloth out from this table. But his magic skills are fake. The cups all fly around and break. The bad hat laughs. The girls are sad. Now Madeline is really mad. If you can't behave in a proper way, please Pepito, go away. Fine, he says. I don't want to stay. It's a silly party anyway. He starts to leave, but in comes a cake. Maybe Pepito made a mistake. The cake is a surprise from Madeline's father. The girls all cheer and hug each other. As the 
cake is cut the boy's heart sings i should have been nicer pepito thinks he is followed home by a cloud of gloom now pepito cries alone in his room then he hears the big bang bong of the doorbell's mighty gong he sees madeline at the door but what has she come here for there was an extra slice of cake i thought that you might like to take pepito looks up down and all around he kicks a rock lying on the ground he says i am sorry for how i behaved before i promise not to be such a brat anymore pepito thanks marilyn for the lovely treat and the two good friends sit down to eat that was a nice story that was nice of madeline to bring pepito a cake i hope you all enjoyed listening to the story that was frozen doll reading madeline's tea party See you soon again